Hey everyone, so today I'm showing you a quick way of creating a toggle switch. Now you can use a toggle switch for a variety of different things. In a few videos ago I showed you how to use how to create a toggle switch to toggle closed captions on and off, how to toggle media playing and pausing, and today I'm just going to show you how to use a toggle to change a variable from true to false and back again. So one use that you would have for switching from true to false would be if you say just want to trigger something only when uh, the variable is either true or false. So this is how we would do it. On the screen I have an oval here and it has a normal and a selected state so we can see what happens when we click um, the toggle switch and then we're going to create a new trigger or sorry actually we're going to go into the manage project variables and I'm going to create a new true false variable called toggle and the default value can be false that's fine then we want to create a trigger and the trigger is going to be an adjust adjust variable and toggle to a value of true. So the key here is that we want to set, uh, we want to change the set toggle to the toggle variable. So instead it's going to say toggle toggle or you could have it equal to a certain value. We want it to be toggle. And we're going to click OK. And now when we preview this, okay, we can see that it's turning on and off, which is great. And so you can more easily see this. We're going to create a text variable. And we're going to insert a reference. Or sorry, we're going to create a text box. We're going to insert a reference variable to the one toggle variable that we have. And I'm going to increase the size of the font. And this way you can see it change. As I click on the oval, you can see it change from true to false. So it starts as false, true, false, true. So that's a very quick way of creating a toggle, um, I guess a toggle switch in Articulate Storyline.